Hello, welcome back to another subscription review live. I'm Paul Chambers, co-founder and CEO of Subta, and you are? Chris George, <laughs> co-founder and chairman. Welcome back, everybody. And we're just deciding our entourage characters. Yes. And I decided I would be the grounded, let's keep things under control, E, Eric character. Yep. And I'm Vinny, right? I thought you'd be Turtle, my dri the driver. What? <laughs> Yeah. No. <laughs> All right. You'd be Vinny. You'd be Vinny Chase. I'm going to be Vinny Chase. We are here today not to talk about Entourage. We're here today to do our subscription review of Washington Post. Yes. Now, this is a bit controversial, right? Because people could be like, oh, Washington Post. I'm I'm not going to read that trash. Or they could be like, Washington Post, really good level-headed articles. Well, what but that's what we're here to talk about. Right, and they're an, they're an original subscription company. They are. How long have they been around now? Probably a million years. A million. Okay, so <laughs> hundreds of years. Yeah, the, the print industry has been in existence, and they're some of the originators of subscriptions. Right, and that's you know that that for us is a fun approach to it because there's been a big shift to digital. You know, in all seriousness, that's what we're here to talk about today: political views, whether whatever you nope. think of the news source aside. We, we're going to look at the subscription process, and that's the goal of this show to give you that blueprint for success. Yeah, so it'll be interesting to see how they get people to sign up for the digital subscription. They were so used to like flyers and doing more traditional sort of marketing strategies to acquire customers. Now I'm interested to see what they're doing to get people to sign up for the digital. So excited to dive in. All right, so let's dive into it. It'll be curious to see now as we go to Google and we type Washington Post, will a competitor come up trying to Kind of snipe that business. Should we do that or like top? No, yeah, probably Washington, Washington Post. Post. Okay. Now, the other thing to consider is there's so many different ways people subscribe to Washington Post today because you know, you've got Apple News, that's a source. There's other ways they're being pulled in together. You're finding, you know, partnerships if you subscribe to, you know, like it's yeah. not that, but not happening right now, but like Netflix may say like add Washington Post here. So yes, we're seeing some new and unique ways. Or Verizon or something of that nature. We're going the traditional route. Yep. So they're buying their own keyword. Should be. great. Yep. Doesn't we'll seem to be any competitors. Let's either. see who's below them. So their Twitter oh, comes stuff. up right away, which is great. Their Facebook page, their Wikipedia. So it looks it's, like they've pretty, yeah, and it makes yeah, sense. kind of to be expected. So we'll yeah. go in through the kind of the standard We'll save route. you a, a PPC click. Yeah. You're welcome. Uh, so we've got the standard homepage here. We're going to see some news now. Notice it looks like the newspaper almost. Yeah, it feels. Yeah, it's got feels that feel. You notice? Will that ever go away? So let's see something we want to read about. I saw earlier when I was just scrolling about Elon Musk and his Twitter stake. It's kind of gone now. So we'll just. Oh, I just I just got to. Okay, so this is the first article. I think it's gated. Okay, so now we clicked into an article. Immediately got, get a pop up. Stay pop informed up with your free trial to the Washington Post. Twenty four seven coverage. Thousands of journalists. Subscribe exclusive events. Unmatched political and international news. Get four weeks free. Now, so let's say you. I Do you think that. that's a newspaper mentality? The weeks thing. Yeah, for sure, because it's a weekly. Yeah, it's a weekly paper, right? It's not get one month free, which right. is our like our traditional mindset, right? And, or days free and subscription. Now, is the digital Washington Post putting out new content daily? It have to be. Yeah. So was the Washington Post when it was a print, was it a daily newspaper? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. And, and so. Gosh, what a way they had to type this out and print it. And, yeah, by hand. On the typewriter. Gosh. You still have to type it out. <laughs> I know, but it just feels different. Yeah, the print. I, yeah. I like. Look, I, I still appreciate it. I tried well, finding. You're a, a little bit older, you know. Yeah, you're a little bit yeah. older than me, you know. I'm still like, a young buck out here. You're more sophisticated when you're reading the newspaper <laughs> and you, holding. You it are less print. tech savvy, kind of <laughs> like when we went to the airport five years ago, and I had my boarding pass on my phone, and his was still printed. Had to be safe. He's like had the tech guy. Sorry, he's the tech guy. So we've got this pop. No matter where we scroll down, we're able to read this article. Uh, see the pieces of it. So we can read the whole thing. Yeah. They, so so they, didn't, the they didn't article. gate it. They didn't gate it, but we immediately got our, our pop-up down there. Let's go back to this other article we want to read. Elon Musk and his Twitter tirade and all the drama happening around that. I didn't think you were an Elon Musk fan, so I'm surprised you wanted to read this one. I mean, oh, you either love or hate Elon Musk. But Interesting. So ads are popping. I bet you that doesn't come when you're a member. Or maybe. Maybe, maybe yep. not. You know, it's we've got ads in different spots here, so... Got some uh, 
you know, again, we were able to read this article. Yep. Let's see Is it because we... it's an older one? No, I don't think so. I mean, look, let's go to the homepage now and, and get to uh, kind of what the headlines are here for the day. Sometimes, too, their headlines might... A lot of ads. Oh, here we go. Can we exit? So we're on our second article. Yeah, after the second article. We're on our third, I'm sorry. We've yeah. been through two for free. So we know Reed Curley, who's one of our partners at Subta, mm -hmm. came out with a really good report around free trial. Mm -hmm. And so I think the stat was on media and publications, it was 70%, nearly 70% were offering some sort of free trial. In essence, they have nothing to lose here uh, because they're... It's already created. Yeah, it's already created. You're working to get people in the door. Um, were there any follow-up sets on that that you recall? Yeah, 15 days is the average. Okay. Is and the then, average given. Yeah, that's and I've seen that a lot out there in the industry is that two weeks. Like yep. People are going to make up their mind in two weeks. Right. I'd be curious if they've A-B tested this and why they less or more. lean towards four weeks. I think one of the things that... I don't have, remember the stats on this... But there was a test on, there's some stats around whether or not you take the credit card mm -hmm. right away versus not taking the credit card when giving the yeah, free there's, trial. That's a, that's a big thing too. Now, we know it takes 30 days to build a habit. So is that four weeks working towards habit building of you're reading yeah. the and post every day too? Probably in this case because you might be reading it every day. So you're getting more interaction within 30 days and maybe another sort of right. description. Okay. So you got monthly four weeks free, yearly four weeks free. So that's interesting because what's the what's the benefit of going yearly? You're only paying four dollars every four weeks, and this is it's like this is best value, but it's not really illustrating that for you. Like I know, yeah. What does I'm, that cost me? I mean, I'm going to pay an extra. Was that four dollars for four weeks times twelve? Forty eight dollars. Right. So you're saving eight dollars. Yeah. That should say here. Then forty dollars for the first year save. But it shouldn't say saving eight dollars. Just say saving twenty percent. Yes. You know because the percentage to me it's like bigger. oh whatever eight dollars I'll just keep paying. Yes. Weekly. But the percentage I'm, number is bigger. I'm saving twenty percent. Yeah. I also wonder about this price point. Um, it's interesting and it, like I almost feel like sometimes they could charge more. Like forty dollars doesn't feel like. No, but what was a newspaper back in the day? Or back. What is the news? Right? It had to be it's delivered. Always, it's always buried. Right? right. So again, this is like, think about what it's compared to. You can you can be subscribed to Apple TV for five dollars a month, and you get sure. Well, now it's streaming and Bye. movies. You know, like yeah, it's not it's probably comparable in terms of the value. They don't expect people to reuse it every single day. Things like that. I mean, again, it's not you know, it's same four weeks free, four dollars every four weeks. I mean that does break down. You get more weeks. Out of, you get more transactions out That's of a year. That's why they did that. Uh, so it, you know, mentally, I'm like, oh, okay, four dollars yeah. a month, but it's actually, you know, I'm going to get two. You're going to get yes, extra two transactions. Yeah, or at least extra whatever it is. So uh, another oh. interesting point in here is two things. One, I can continue with PayPal if I want to, which is you know a good way to look at it. Or I can view more offers. Yeah, let's see. Nice. All digital access. And premium digital. What do they get? A bonus subscription to share. So I can share this with a friend, yep. a family member. Uh, 3 day digital passes to share. So I can give somebody access for a short period of oh. time just for the next So every days. month you get one to give away. Okay. Exclusive ebooks. So what's great about this, I remember seeing this with HelloFresh and Blue Apron, is I bet you there's a pretty good take rate somebody gets it for free they didn't like it they're now signing up they get the information the individual they can hit them up with offers and get them to join i feel like they should be giving this in the base one for sure there, there's like this is a nice thing i'm doing customer for, like, i'm not going to pay extra just to like help my friends the bonus subscription makes sense here right the monthly 30-day digital access should be in the in the all access yeah and, and i think Two, you can sweeten the pot a little more. And this is interesting. You know, you look at like what New York Times has done with their acquisition of Wordle recently and some of the others that they've made to try and add to their portfolio. Because then what they can do is start to build out. What's more the cost levels. of this one? Oh, it's six. Yeah, six dollars every four weeks. Yeah. So an extra two dollars every four weeks. Yep, but thirty percent more every four weeks. That's See, significant. That's it's, great. it's 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 unique how you 
We're in each of those things. Now, we also have other subscription options. We have Gift, Enterprise, Academic. Oh, they have print here still. And print. So let's See, they look got at here. 4084 in our office. Can I don't we think get it? I don't think so. We cannot get it. Yeah. To the zip code. So it would have to be, you know, 101, 25, I'm guessing on a... No, it doesn't exist. That's a zip code in Mars. <laughs> I mean, maybe. One right. one. What is 10125? Is that? I know 210. Uh, no. Probably one in Washington. I'm trying to think. Yeah, no, I know. I was trying to think of like a bigger zip code. You know, it, yeah. But anyway, we, sh we should know zip codes by heart. We don't, clearly. No. This no. is a fail. We can Google like New York <laughs> zip code. So it looks like we got gift subscriptions. We got enterprise solutions. So, like a big organization that wants to get this. And then we've got an academic rate. So, that's for, for students and teachers. So, yeah. I think that's great. I think like you said, the great thing about this digital subscription is they're going to create all this content, whether they got a thousand subscribers or 10 million subscribers, there's not a huge increase in costs. Right. Right. There's, yeah, yeah there's not a big, and See, look at this, this student one's a dollar every four weeks. It's not, it's not bad. And you just have to do some verification on it. So I'm sure they've Do you got, think when you sign up for this, they email you news? Yeah. You I would email. imagine there's an option in there. Yeah. So we can go through and try it. Um, let's go back to the homepage before we try those. See what else they have going on there. Or no, maybe not. Well, let's see. I mean, obviously, I don't think we're going to be able to go deep into, uh, you know, the options. Do they have an there. exit intent with an offer, too? Oops. We'll click into, back into it. Let's scroll around and try to leave and see if it hits with the offer. You know what's interesting? I wonder if they should have put no ads, too. This is not loading very fast. So well, it could not... be our, our connection here. Is it? Might be. Well, we'll check with the IT guy. <laughs> yeah, we'll check with the IT guy. However, I think you know there's a, there's a lot to be you know looked at here from an exit intent standpoint. We're not getting any offers thrown to us on this. That's code that's built into the site. Whether yeah. or not like we're loading, yeah. that's the first line yeah. of code you're loading in the header. So that should be happening right now. So that's interesting to see. And you know, as we continue, we're going to try and get into stuff again as we're loading up the site. Yeah. We're, we're not going to be able to browse anymore. So let's sign up. Read anymore. Continue with this. Add your email. So I've got zero dollars today. Create an account and continue. Now Wait, this is this is taking. This is ten dollars. Oh. Four dollars every four weeks for one year. After one year, it goes to ten. Oh, that's funny. That didn't come in until just now. Slid in there. The old Comcast approach. The old, I'm going to cancel. <laughs> okay, I'll put you back at the normal yeah, rate. Yeah, okay. We'll play this game. So, all right, we've got to enter in some four, zero, four. credit card info. All right, so we're going to do one of two things here. I can plug in my credit card information, and our audience can have a wild day on Amazon buying whatever they want, or we can have Bradley distract them. Let them buy whatever they want. I say distract them. Oh, okay, we'll distract them. The Cube Awards are here, and it's the most important night in direct to consumer subscriptions. This event takes place live June 2nd at Sub Summit in Orlando, Florida. The Cube Awards gathers the biggest brands in subscription commerce for a celebration of the industry's achievements. There will be various awards given, everything from best startup to best customer experience. Come connect with leaders and innovators in the industry to learn what they did to get nominated for one of these prestigious awards. And after the event, we celebrate even more at the Cube Awards After Party. The Cube Awards and the After Party are included in your Sub Summit ticket. Be a part of the biggest night in direct-to-consumer subscriptions. Go to subsummit.com and get your ticket today. Don't worry, everybody. I took a picture of this credit card. It's also your credit card. Oh, <laughs> oh. So, uh, got a credit card information plugged in, and you watch the Cube Awards promo there at Sub Summit coming up here June 2nd. If you're attending Sub Summit, free ticket to the Cube Awards. Don't miss it. It's going to be amazing. Uh, so, coincidentally, good distraction. Yeah, good distraction. We were able to get our credit card information plugged in. It sent, uh, it asked now, it took us to another page asking for a password, which I've already keyed in. And I will hit get started here. You can see here it's reminding me the important information about my subscription. 
what to expect, what's going to happen, and confirmation on the next billing date, which are things that are required by law at this point. I wonder how many cards don't go through. On that page? Like, how do they know? They just took your info, they're going to try They're not going to try it for four weeks. No, well, they, did, they did a validation right there. They did? Okay. Yeah, they're validating the card. At oh, least. pre auth? Really, yeah, just a pre auth on there. Yeah. So we know it's good. So I'm uh, now creating an account. I can get signed in. So it looks like we're good to go here. Now. Tell us a little bit about your interests. Okay. Oh, all right. So a little recommendation. Like curated content towards what your interests are. Yeah. And this is, uh, this is what's interesting is this, we're now a data point for them. And I will, you know, if the, remember the rules that the product is free, you are the product, the product right? Now we're, we're in both here. At this point. Well, yeah, it's not free. It's free now. So you're the product yeah. now, but then. You are paying for the I also wonder like, if they should offer free news to some level as long as you give up a data point every sure. once in a while. What's the value of the data point? Share more. You know? also, yeah, consistently update in data. Interesting. It's an interesting approach, Paul. Yeah. So I'm just clicking things right now. Uh, so get interest in your inbox so we can select if we want to see different things. I'm interested in signing up for a bunch of newsletters at this point in time. The optimist. The optimist. So select the optimist. No, I don't want it. I'm an optimistic human. All right, fine. You need to be one too. I'm not doing it. I'm signing for. I'm not getting newsletters right now. Okay. Okay. So the not now is super great. I actually didn't think I could click it, but it's there. Oh, My it's birthday. Your birthday. Is there nine? Twenty-eight. Nineteen seventy-four. Oops, nineteen ninety-four. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, use the camera mobile. Oh, this is fun. So now I can take my mobile device and scan this. I can get the. You know, it's helping me get connected on the mobile app. Again, creating that stickiness. Yes. Right. That's what you want. So this is a great thing in that process of creating. An, okay. Now I've got the app on my phone. I'm less likely yes. to cancel it if I'm more engaged. So I wonder what they that, start sending me push notifications. What's that stickiness number? So I was watching. So I read about Uber. It was two rides, and they're a customer for life. Yeah. Yeah, and I've seen that report with like restaurants and, and different places. Yes. You get people in that third time, they're significantly more likely to to build Stay, that loyalty yeah. and that habit. So. Um, maybe there's some data behind the app openings out there. So again, we are, uh, so this brought us back to the article we had originally clicked on and we're looking to read here. So let's see. So we'll we'll read. Page. So we're something good. I'll just click in, in things here just to see weather, before we go to the tornadoes. Oh, we're so up in here. I mean, just lots of rain. April showers bring May flowers. That's all we need. All right, so we've got our account. Uh, just to keep things concise and brief today, we should go to the cancellation page and yes. zoom through that process. This is a very important part of any business, right? We want to know, this is what, like a big reason we do this. What's going to happen when the consumer goes to cancel? What are the questions they might ask? What are the offerings? A lot of cases we've seen some really good flows. In some cases, we saw no flows. So let's just see what they do. So where should we go here to cancel? cancel? Oh, so we should probably go to my account if there is one. It's hard for me to see. Click account call. settings. Click call on the top right. Okay, so I did that, and this menu oh. popped out. Yeah, account settings. Or help desk. It's interesting. What you're saying is, yeah, it's not obvious. So my subscriptions. Cancel my subscription. Okay. Pretty, pretty straightforward. Got yeah, so it's interesting though because I, instead of my account, what did it say? My settings or my account? My settings? post. No, it was something else you clicked on. Well, I clicked on my name and then it had my post account settings. Yeah, right account there. settings, okay. So I clicked on here, cancel my subscription. So right away, help us support others deliver exclusive in depth content. So they just are hitting us with something? Your support helps us deliver exclusive in depth reporting. Thank you for helping support coverage you won't find anywhere else. It's almost like guilting us into into not canceling at this point. It's like if you if you cancel, we're gonna lose your support, and your support is helping us do these really yeah. good things. I bet you this is uh, content based on your interests. They're trying sure. to keep you in the game. I guess so, yeah. I mean I don't remember what I clicked. I right. probably shouldn't have clicked so fast, but you know. So yeah, there you know because this is very you know this has political nature, right? Those yeah. that are you know want to help help our party and, and help support yeah. our cause. So boy, if I'm not, these investigators yes, yes, aren't going to yes. be able to continue to do their job out there. Right, 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 right. Interesting approach. Yeah. The, the, the old guilt trip. Yep. And, you know, pretty from canceling. I'm not a fan of it, but it might work. Yep. You know, and it's, 
that's what's true. Now we have this here, if you continue to cancel your limited access will end on May 11th, so it's our next billing date, unless you are on a free trial, and it will end today. Oh, that's super interesting. If like, sorry, you're losing your free trial now. Too yeah. bad. That's because they had so many people that were probably putting in their info, canceling, getting their four weeks feed, because we'll read that one or two articles. Yeah. They said, okay, well, we're going to end your free yeah. trial. Yeah. Which makes sense. Yeah, look, if you're not going to commit, then get yeah. out. Yeah. Now, it's what's interesting like here is ones. they made the continue to cancel bigger mm -hmm. than the stay. Yeah. Which I almost would reverse these. Yeah, there's some... Well, like what we see a lot of companies do in, in the... I, you know, you, you use this language up here, your guilt trip, like, I've decided to continue supporting you. Yep. I'll stay. Yep. Sort of thing. Instead of, like, I've changed my mind. But yeah, that's what it is. All right. So here's the old survey. Tell us why you're canceling. Still have unlimited access. Oh, cancel. It doesn't make any or... sense to me. Still have unlimited access through, but your, your free trial yeah. one today. Interesting. Uh, promotion, I have to just too expensive. Too expensive? Yeah. Again, we got the I've changed my mind. Yep. Cancel and blue. No. Done. Done. No, no, you're not trying to win me back. Yeah. <laughs> so, that's so it. realistically, we would have liked to have seen an offer there. Pause your subscription. It's too expensive, so we can put you on a 30 day pause and then you can get them going. Or just start asking questions, right? This is a good chance. If I said it's too expensive, what was a more ideal price point yes. for you? If you could pick your price for this, what would you pay? And let yeah. it scale by. We've been seeing that a lot lately. Which and sometimes, a like, if they choose a, a range that makes sense for your business, you could throw them that yeah. offer and say, like, hey, we yep. can keep you on for $3. Or for stay on for one more month for $1. Keep, give us another try for one more month. $1. Yeah. Now you got them. And then they'll renew for 4 after that. Now this is something like $4. If you can't afford $4 every four weeks for, for this. Yeah, I, I would be – I bet you not as many people select too expensive. Yeah, yeah. It would be nice – yeah. But again, like there, there's an opportunity. The point being there's an yeah. opportunity to collect some data points Correct. here to learn more about your audience, to learn, okay, like pretty cheap. Yes. You're being pretty cheap here. Like what would you have paid? Yeah, yeah, yeah. If but, it's zero, it's zero. And then out of the other selections, I'm assuming there isn't questions, but there should be. One I more also, like, I also come back to supporting, like we'll let you read. You can keep a basic free one at this point. You're only going to get two articles a month. Yeah. But you got to answer questions. And you keep teasing them. With other articles that get you them have to, to tell us out. more about you. What are the yeah. resources are you reading? Yep. What games are you playing? Because yep. these guys really like, like again, coming back to New York Times and their approach, they've made a lot of strategic acquisitions lately because they're realizing, like, let's expand our audience, let's expand our subscription model and expand our revenue. Yeah, makes sense. Because of it. So, yeah. interesting thing to see. So, okay. overall, I think there's some pros and cons in here. So, we learned some new things yep. today. We learned about, you know, the week's approach. Uh, we looked at, you know, some of the various free trial offering, free trial offer, the pop-ups. We didn't talk a lot about it, but the academic, you know, option. There's some, there's some logistics behind that, Enterprise the verification option. and stuff. But there's some things there, and yeah. uh, you know, some good lessons learned. And I think, look, I think overall they they've done probably a really good job in in, in using the site to acquire new customers. I think there's some work that could be done in the cancel flow, but overall, pretty good. A plus, A, A plus. We don't give anybody A plus. <laughs> Fair enough. I'll give them a B plus. B plus. I'm a retention guy. You're an acquisition guy. Yeah, you know, B plus is fine. B, you know, I'm look, giving, C is average. So I'm giving them a B now. C I'm giving them a B now. <laughs> you're just mad. You can't downgrade them because you're mad at yeah, me. I'm mad. I'm mad. Oh, Letting you know, Sorry, Washington, Washington Post. Post. It is his I fault. Got you too, a B. He just got a B. <laughs> Fair enough. B B plus. You're still above average. Thank you so much for joining us today. Uh, make sure you subscribe to our channel. Follow us on social. We love putting out content like this that helps the community yep. in order to continue to do it. Any final words on Sub Summit coming up? No. Oh, yes. <laughs> Let's say no. Sub Summit is right around the corner. I'm super excited. The whole team is super excited. It's a really exciting time to get back in person. It's going to be the biggest event we've ever had. Yeah. We're looking at 1,500 attendees. We got an exhibit hall with over a hundred exhibitors. The speaker lineup is amazing. rock stars. It's amazing. And, and, and more recently, we just confirmed a couple new speakers, right? And Wise, uh, Wise is coming. One of the gentlemen that built out the Wise subscription has continued to evolve. Is going to be joining us on stage to talk about that. Uh, Netflix is going to be talking about some of their payment practices. No matter what segment of subscription you're in, these are topics and lessons that will help you with your business. So, if you're a subscription box, you're going to learn 
from the owners of that. And that's why we do this show and we look at so many different types of subscription. Because if you're a subscription, uh, subscribe and save, or if you're a digital subscription, these are principles and concepts you can take and apply to your business. That's why we love doing this. Yeah. So thank you again, everybody. Excited to see all of you in June. And we'll be back probably another month, probably with another subscription reviews. Yeah, thanks for tuning in.